Hi guys, I hope you can see um, in this light, it's fading pretty fast. But um, this is the truck that uh, is getting all the interest. Let's uh, hope, it, uh, hope it comes out. Now I am 6'9", 6'10", something like that. And I'm holding this, if you can see my reflection, level with my eyes. My eyesight's there. So <laughs> you can get an idea of how tall this truck is. Um, it's going to be quite a long video, but I, I'm going to try and cover everything. Uh, basically, we've got an ARB um, winch bumper. Uh, that would have been about 1,200 quid. We've got a Super Winch EP9 in there. Uh, that would have been about 450, 500 pound plus delivery, something like that. So there's ugh, just money. Uh, proper TGM snorkel money. This is a front end. Uh, we've painted it all today. Um, because they hadn't finished it, I'm going to talk with uh, whoever's interested in detail about this, but it's now done and legal, it's um, MOT, that sort of thing. You'll notice that the prop is missing, the front prop, that needs making up. I've got one that comes with it that needs shortening. Uh, it'd be about a £60 charge. If somebody wants me to sort that before they take it on, I can do that. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's that. It's got... Um, uh, very adjustable, adjust what I'm on about. Um, the leaves on the front are from a rock crawling company in America, so the, the, the truck does an awful lot of this. Um, you can firm it up by adding more leaves if you want to, but that is the nature of the beast, it's what it's for, it's an off roader. But, um, you know, as long as you don't expect it to tear around bends, you'll be fine, you know, it, it, it's, it's just that's what it is. For example, the, these tyres as well, more, more money, is um, currently for. Four, they are £1,400 and there's six of them because <laughs> you have two spares on the back. Um, I hope you're adding this up. <laughs> there's uh, TJM, um, uh, the XGS suspension system on there as well. There is a Detroit locker in the back. That's a form of um, locking differential that goes in the back there. That was £650 plus VAT and fitting. So there's nearly a grand's worth of diff in there. There's another winch in the back in a separate tray, which has never, ever, ever been used. Um, this tray made up was Fortunes, powder coated, properly done. And as well, the, the roll cage and everything, I'm going to get up on the roof now by standing up here and show you it. Look, look at it. I mean, it's just so OTT. It's awesome. Again, powder coated by a company called OEC. If you were looking for one of these to be done to your truck, two and a half, three grand wouldn't be out of the question, you know. Um, it's a custom built, custom fabricated, powder coated cage. It's it's awesome. Um, I don't know if you can see this here, but uh, if you can you see that that scoop in there that leads to. Let's go on the back again. That leads to a custom rad alley radiator with uh, with a with a Kenlo esque fan on the back. Um, that's because all of the cooling has been taken away from the front. The reason that's happened. Um, is because an intercooler has been added. This is a turbo engine. It goes really, really well. Uh, Mark IV, you've got a turbo diesel. So uh, it's been intercooled for, for a bit more performance. Um, we've got uh, the uh, rock sliders, tree sliders, whatever you want to call it as well. I mean, there's just thousands and thousands of pounds. We reckon 18 and a half grand has gone into taking it from a standard truck to what you see there. Um, including the five grand original bill that he paid for the for the truck, which I've got receipts for as well. Uh, so that's that's it basically. You point this at something, it's going to go over it, under it, through it, whatever. It is just awesome. Winches front and rear. You can see the bodywork's in good nick. You know, there's obviously a little dink there, uh, and there's a little dink just underneath here. But again, a bit of nature of the beast, isn't it? You know, um, inside uh, again is is uh, is respectable, is good. You know, all the seats and everything are. You just probably need to clean, you know, but uh, they're all they're all where they should be. Steering wheels and things are all, you know, normal. Um, as far as the back goes, because all of this cage is bolt on, I don't know if you can see um, bolt on here. It could be taken off, and you could fit a tub if you really wanted to. But uh, let's face it, it just it just looks awesome, doesn't it? Absolutely awesome. So there's a long video. I apologise for that, but hopefully we've covered you know most things I, I think I've probably forgotten a load but um, yeah there you go any questions give us a shout 07746 466 566 thanks very much